Hey guys, Frankie Jacks here, and I just finished watching The Wolverine. Albeit I saw it on bootleg, and I didn't get to see that ending scene after the credits. Read all about it. I saw a clip of it later on the internet, which is pretty awesome. And uh, The Wolverine. I like the movie The Wolverine. I didn't think I was going to. I don't like when my superheroes are weak and at their most vulnerable. But this was this was cool. This is cool the way they did it. And some stuff happened to Wolverine. If you don't want to know what major thing happened to him, stop watching right now. Okay, so you're still watching. So you've either seen the movie or don't care about me telling you what happened. He gets his claws cut off. I know, how can he lose his adamantium claws? I guess there's like some super adamantium that if you heat it up or add lasers to it or some crap, whatever they did to it, uh, that can cut through anything, you know, even adamantium. So he got his claws cut off by the very dude who he saved his life 70 years ago. Crazy. Crazy as hell. Okay. So that happened. And then I'm thinking, okay, how's he going to get his claws back? Well, bone claws pop out. I'm like, okay, Wolverine cannot have bone claws. I mean, this might make an interesting facet to who he is and what he does. But uh, then again, maybe not. So I have a glimmer of hope for him in the, in the next movie that he's in as Wolverine, Hugh Jackman. Hopefully he does the next X-Men movie. Uh, Magneto comes into play. And if you guys remember, Magneto was able to like suspend him up in that train and, and bend his claws and stuff, right? Well, maybe Magneto can reattach his claws for him. I mean, he is the master of metal. Sometimes he can be a douche, but you know, sometimes he's not a bad guy. I think Magneto is going to fuse his claws back in there so he has them again. I mean, the nubs are there, um, so he's got something to work with. Uh, maybe he won't have razor thin claws. I would, I would hate to see that. I want some big honking claws on my Wolverine, and they better be made of indestructible metal. I'm just saying. So that's my, my theory. Magneto's going to fix his claws. I mean, he still has them. They're somewhere. They're, I mean, they're stuck in some dude's head. Um, but, you know, I'm sure that he retrieved them, and he's going to try and find a way to fix them. I mean, it's a part of him. Can't be Wolverine without those claws. And bone claws? Just not going to do the job. Let me know what you guys think down below. Thanks, and uh, peace.